Hey, have a good day. Hello there. This is a video on some tavern maps I've created through the months. Nothing like a good old tavern for your party to rest and have fun after quests. Of course, it is at your discretion to add something weird or evil within, or turn the tavern into a mimic. Again, I'll be showcasing it like a story of sorts. Our storyteller for this video will be Feistus the Goblin. Hello there, good to be here. Feistus has followed a merry band of adventurers on their quest to stop the Elder Gods from getting unsealed. He is there whenever the adventurers needed some good rest, and these taverns are his. You know what they say, Mr. Shark? An apple keeps the doctor away, but a long rest keeps death at bay. <laughs> Very much so, my friend. Now, without further ado, let's get on with the maps. Now where do I start? Ah, yes. On the lands of Feyrun, a group of adventurers named the Fool's Folly have overcome hurdles the likes of which can even make a seasoned veteran call to his mama. <laughs> they fought the followers of these Elder Gods on every quest, killed an ancient dragon, and spearheaded a siege against castle, and plain thwarted the plans of evildoers. But as mighty as these heroes are, every hero needs a safe haven for them to rest in. To not rest is to entice exhaustion. To entice exhaustion will bring about death. That's where my taverns come in, of course. For our first one, we have Ram's Goats. A mishmash of furniture haphazardly placed on the cold stone floor. A grand piano and instrument sits on the stage at the eastern end of the tavern for any bard to play their tune. A stone fireplace sits on the west, giving a little warmth to weary travelers. Nothing too fancy in this tavern. It's more pit stop than safe haven. But it gets the job done, so it's cheap. Upgrading from that, the Bull's Horn, run by a friendly minotaur who serves the best steaks. Yes, a cow selling steaks, go figure. This tavern is more organized, with aptly chosen oak furnishings to give it a more rustic feel. On the top right, we have the bar table connecting to the kitchens. The storage room is on the top left of the tavern. This is where they keep most of the supplies, as well as the Minotaur's doll collection. Why he has doll collection? I have no clue either, and I wasn't gonna ask. This tavern also comes with private rooms at the bottom of the building, separated by a curtain for privacy, and each coming with complimentary house beverages. You also might be wondering about that dark corner over there. That's where the more edgy clientele sit. They do love to brood in their corners, and we always strive to cater to these sorts. Moving on from the bull's horn, we have Lathander's Rest, a double-story tavern. The lacquered maple wood floors create a cozier environment, complemented with a stone fireplace sitting directly in the middle of the room. On the sides, Two private rooms with their own fireplaces are set up for any private meetings. The special feature of this tavern is that the kitchen storage has a built-in cooling enchantment. It keeps the food fresh for longer, increasing the quality of their food and drink by leaps and bounds. The rooms for stay lies on the second floor of the building. Patrons are able to look down upon the first floor from the interior balcony as if God's looking down on us mortals. And there you have it, three taverns for your weary adventurers to rest in, each of them with their own styles and price ranges for you masters to use. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have matters to attend. Great evil breaking out of their seals, 
a kingdom in turmoil, an assassination which threw a nation into chaos. Better get ready for what is to come. Unless the fools folly find themselves, we know the place to rest. It was nice to be on the show, Shark. Till next time. Thank you so much for coming, Mr. Faisus. These taverns can be found on the block spots. You can freely use them however you wish. It would also be very helpful to me if you credit me if you use them. I hope you enjoyed today's segment on maps for tabletop RPGs. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more. Have a good day!